Hey, 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 everybody. It's Yasmin here, a.k.a. Yazzy. Yaz, Yazzy Fizzle Tizzle, Yazzy Speaks. It has been a very long time since I've seen you. I am officially living in New York. In New York, concrete jungle where dreams are made of. There's nothing we can't do. Now I'm in New York. Yeah, it's real. It's real. So, um... I've been doing a lot of growing. I really, really have. And I'm pretty sure that you can kind of see that. Um, I'm 21 years old. I've never felt better. There are still many lonely moments, but I keep pressing through because I just know that there's something there. I know that I have a purpose. I know that I have a reason for living. And, and, and as much as it hurts some days, I'm not going to let that stop me until my time is up. So I wrote this poem. Uh, I was going through a lot of things and I wrote this poem. And, and look, the, the poem is obviously throwing shade. But trust me, like I have completely gotten over all of the things that I went through. And I also realized that it's not always the other person. Sometimes it's actually you. But this is just, um, you know, my... The title of my hashtag, you know, Yazzie Speaks on Twitter and Instagram. Like, you see Yazzie Speaks, but you probably don't really know exactly what that means. And I do write poetry. I'm a spoken word artist. I just don't do it as often. But uh, I usually write poetry when I'm really sad, when I'm depressed, when I'm angry, when I'm deep in thought, even when I'm extremely happy. So here is my poem and I hope that you enjoy it. Fake smile, real smile, half a mile. <laughs> what a year that this has been. You only stop to speak to me when it is of your benefit. You walk past me briskly. Of course, I have to be the one to speak first. And you give me that oh so obviously fake smile. Ha! Huh. That's not really a smile. It is pain on your face smudged into some sort of expression that is a sorry, sorry semblance of a smile. I smile back genuinely because you are not slick. I am comfortable with the skin I am in and I am sure that what you thought you had set up for my demise, the Lord has worked out for my good because I love him. I don't know where you got such arrogance and ideas of entitlement from. Entitlement, you gasp. Pride? Privilege? Yes, you subconsciously feel all of these things and have the audacity to get mad at me when I don't stroke your petty ego. Oh no, that's not me. I don't even suck up to teachers. That's not my style. I earn my A. And I take my more frequent B's and rare C's as a mere part of my SpaghettiOs alphabet soup. I am confident standing on my own two feet. I don't walk in anybody's shadow or pull people near me so it appears that I am the special one or leader of the wolf pack. And my spirit is keen to decipher spirits like yours. At first, you fooled me. You fooled me real good. But I'm not falling for that again. Yes, go ahead. Be salty as the sea, as the deep sea. Go ahead and exclude me or exploit me and think that you're ignoring me will hurt me because eventually the shoe will be on the other foot. Oh no, I won't be the one to put it on you because I will be too busy doing the things I need to, uh, to do to achieve ultimate success. Don't you know that I am a black woman? The essence of struggle, the definition of tough. What did you say? Oh, what's that got to do with it? You're black too? <laughs> You have no idea. The mess you are trying to throw on me is only preparing me for the greater work I have to do to upbuild his kingdom. See, the difference between you and me, there are several. But the main one, you are interpreting this in the flesh, in the here and now. But I am praying every day for discernment to see in the spirit. See, you don't fool me. For our battle is not against flesh and blood, but it is against the principalities and evil spirits. Oh, I didn't say I'm better than you. Or that I'm perfect because I'm not. But you need to pipe down and have a seat because I am not your inferior. 
And like the kindergartner say, you are not the boss of me. Yes, go ahead and step to the side as I dust off my tail feathers. Your time is up. Your game is over. Truth will prevail. Love will rule. And I will be smiling at you. But it will be a real smile. Hope you liked it. Deuces.